All right, people, welcome back. Another fake card Friday. So today we are looking at a synchro monster that has the same requirements as Quasar. So similar to that upgrade of Spark, we're going to be looking at this card and, of course, comparing it to Quasar to see if this card is real. Would you make it over Quasar? So this is GSAAA Perfect Protocol Exo Kernel. It's a uh, level 12 machine synchro effect monster, Earth. 4,000 attack, 4,000 defense. So I believe it's actually Quasar's stats. So, okay. Uh, one tuner synchro monster plus two or more non tuner synchro monsters. So, Quasar's materials. Uh, must be synchro summoned and cannot be special summoned by other ways. Understandable. Once per turn, you can change every monster your opponent controls to face up attack position. Semicolon. Negate their effects. Then this card gains 200 attack for every monster your opponent controls and can attack every monster your opponent controls once each. So, that might be game, depending on how many monsters your opponent controls. A oh, Quasar can attack twice, just period, you know, just even if it's just two direct attackers, attack, attack, game. Uh, this card can attack every single one of your opponent's monsters with a 4,000 plus monster. So, let's just say, hypothetically speaking, opponent has five monsters, you're gaining a thousand attack, they're all in attack mode, and you're attacking every single one of them with a 5,000 monster. Like, depending on where your opponent sits with five points, that might be game. Uh, next effect, monsters other than this card. Uh, cannot attack the turn and use this effect, but have any battle damage your opponent receives that turn. So while you have this 5,000 beater that's attacking all your opponent's monsters, I mean, well, 4,000 plus, uh, all the damage they take is halved. So that's, that's a little bit weaker, you know? Like if I'm going to be busting out a powerful synchro monster that's this and all the material, I want every single effect. You know, the whole flip up to attack position, their effects are negated so that you don't even get any flip effect or they can't even live and attack if uh, they can't be destroyed by battle. Uh, that's fine, but having the battle damage received, like I, I, I pull off synchro play, a synchro summon uh, beyond comparison. Why is my damage still half? Like I don't like that. Uh, this card cannot be targeted or destroyed by your opponent's card effects. All right, so uh, unlike Quasar, who can negate something, but then it's pretty much affected by everything. But when it's removed from sale, do you get a shooting star? This card just can't be targeted or destroyed by your uh, opponent's card effects, similar to uh, uh, Leo in uh, Moonlights. You know, can't be targeted or destroyed, but you're still affected by card effects as long as they don't target or destroy you. So yeah, watch out for that. Uh, and if this card is sent to the graveyard, you can special summon all non-tuner synchro materials used for this card super summon from your graveyard, but their effects are negated. So pretty much all the synchro monsters that want the, the tuner synchro monster, they will use get to go ahead and get summoned back if, you know, they're allowed to. Their effects are negated, but they're still beaters, so you at least get something in return similar to uh, Quasar. Uh, overall, this isn't bad, you know. Uh, it really depends. Like, if this was actually a, uh, uh, a real card... It, it would it really would de de depend on the situation that uh, you want to go. Like if it's just straight up, let's go ahead and get it in with Quasar because you know two direct some Quasar. That's it. Eight thousand, eight thousand. I mean four thousand, four thousand. That's generally game. While well, this just like well, you know, I gain all the attack and then I switch all the monsters attacks to monster to attack mode. I attack each one of them, but the damage is half, and I'm not getting that direct attack in that turn. It's just uh, it's nice that you can't be targeted or struck by. Uh, Bones card effects, but you're still susceptible to things that don't target or destroy you. Uh, so, you know, watch out for that as well, because, you know, you have Quasar, and your opponent goes, there, I activate Monarch Storm Force, you've got Quasar in the gate. While this is just Monarch Storm Force, tribute you off, gone. So, uh, <laughs> yeah, that's another problem. But still, you know, not being able to be targeted or destroyed by opponent's card effects is uh, a nice effect that we've seen uh, time and time again be very powerful. Um, you know, it'd be better if you were just blatantly unaffected by your opponent's card effects, but, you know, that's that's, that's the second best that you're going to get. And, of course, getting the effect that just when you're sent to a graveyard, period, uh, even if, uh, you know, you're destroyed by battle, you're just sent to a graveyard, period, uh, you get to go ahead and summon the non-tuner uh, materials as well is pretty good. So, I don't know, like I said, it depends. But it's still a lot of work, and uh, during the time, if you're going to go for it, you're going to go for that Quasar. So tell me what you guys think about this card in the comment section below. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this fake card Friday. Of course, I'll be back next Friday with another fake card to look at. So thanks for watching, thanks for all support. And yep, see you guys next Friday with another fake card to look at. Thanks for watching.